Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to our channel. My name is Muhammad Rafi and you are watching Rate Studio. Well, today we are gonna be talking and taking a look at a really dope gaming mouse, guys, which is sent us uh, by Pawnage. Well, Pawnage is a US based gaming peripherals company and mostly they are making dope gaming keyboards and mice. Today we are going to review their top notch gaming mouse which is from Breaker which is a magnesium gaming mouse and let's see what is the pros and the cons of this gaming mouse guys. So guys without wasting any of the time now let's start the show. But before moving further guys quickly go down and press the subscribe button and also the bell icon so you can get the notifications of our upcoming videos guys. Now starting from the unboxing of this mouse guys and let's see what contents they have provided you into the box of this mouse. Now talking about the design and the features on this device guys, we got to say the design language is pretty fancy and it steals the viewer attention in an extent. The mouse comes in various different colors profiles and we have the red one over here. The honeycomb pattern which is basically extending from the back of the mouse all the way up to the front of the gaming buttons and it totally looks insane. Also there is a kind of a pattern on the sides of this mouse and of course there are some fancy cutouts at the bottom as well. Overall a pretty fancy and a dope design language. Moving towards the build quality and the hand feel of this mouse. Well as you know guys it's a magnesium alloy mouse and this thing is like really solid and strong and it's not going to go anywhere over like 5 to 6 years. There is hardly any noticeable flex in the mouse assembly. Uh, this is a benefit of using the magnesium rather than going for the plastic and the aluminum design. Uh, it's light but strong at the same time and the weight of this gaming mouse is just under 50 gram. Uh, pretty impressed by the build quality they are offering. Moreover, Pawnage is also claiming that their Storm Breaker come with a density of only 0.16 gram per centimeter cube which is lower than the average mount density in the uh, industry guys. If you see at the bottom of this mount there are 100% PTFE feeds which helps a lot in the smooth gliding uh, of this mouse and also for the quick movement and the control. By the way if you uh, want you can also go with the glass feeds you can replace it's included in the box. Uh, one fancy feature they have uh, on this mouse is the ability to change the position of the sensor for optimal uh, aiming during uh, the gameplay and also for your uh, daily usage guys. Uh, they are using the PixR3395 sensor in this device which is an excellent sensor and which can go up to 26,000 dpi. So you are not gonna uh, be having any kind of a problem which, uh, with this sensor. All of these things are really decent. The main buttons of this mouse are quite responsive, tactile and consistent and they are they have a very clicky feel and it also feels really satisfactory while doing your daily uh, day to day job and also using it for the gaming as well. There is some pre travel and the post travel uh, is moderate but the buttons are responsive firmly, uh, fairly firm and snappy guys. Well Pawnage is using Omron switches for all of the buttons. Uh, there are also two buttons on the side of this mouse which have also a really clicky feel uh, and they are also using the Omron switches for these buttons as well. Uh, but these buttons have uh, uh, rated for only 20 million clicks which I think is uh, significantly uh, less if we compare it with the other mice in the market. Uh, at the bottom you can also see a simple on a switch which is included in nearly all of the mouses uh, in the market. 
Now the scroll wheel is surprisingly amazing on this device guys. Scrolling up and down gives very satisfactory and tactile feedback. Like you get the idea how much clicks you are pulling through. Uh, but the scroll wheel buttons uh, are using an unbranded uh, evaluated tactile switch which requires medium force to put it to action. Uh, and these are all the button present on the storm breaker. Uh, there is literally no other button which can take advantage uh, of during gaming considering that this mouse cost around 179 US dollars guys well this is a small disappointment also uh, the pony storm breakers come with a really sick looking receiver guys which enables it to gain a polling rate of 400 uh, hertz guys uh, which is uh, significantly more than the uh, most the mice present into the market at the time of review but i don't think so uh, that this makes an exceptional and noticeable difference you can download the pony software from their site guys it is pretty easy to understand and basic uh, it's a quite basic software which can be used to map uh, uh, and also the buttons and also to adjust the dpi of the mouse guys uh, also to navigate and the various other gaming profiles there is also an option of slam click prevention guys in the software which basically disable the click uh, if you slam uh, your mouse on the desk <laughs> well it's also a really cool feature now talking about the battery life of this mouse this mouse comes with a battery of uh, 300 megahertz uh, which charge into two hours and give a battery backup of 120 hour which is insane considering to the weight of this mouse ponage is saying that uh, on office use it's going to be a battery backup of 120 but in the gaming guys the battery life will reduce to the 60 hours they also have provided you grips in the box which is really cool uh, in case if you want to apply on uh, for other battery grips uh, during gaming uh, but it will definitely uh, hide the aesthetics and the shape of the mouse guys because the shape of and the design of the grips is a bit different uh, than the grips available uh, in the box at the moment. The gaming performance on this mouse is quite exceptional. Uh, the sensor is snappy and accurate. The input lag in the clicks low to none. The ergonomics of this mouse are very good while playing games on longer section. Uh, it's not going to be cause any pain in your hands. Also, it's very comfortable to uh, hold while gaming. The movement of the sensor also make a significant difference while uh, gaming giving a room for the user to adjust it according to its liking. Moreover, the glide is also really smooth due to the PTFE feet. Well guys, one thing that we will miss in this mouse is the presence of additional buttons which helps a lot during the gaming. Well, overall it's a solid mouse when it comes to gaming. Now in the end, let's talk about the price and the warranty of this mouse. Well, Pawnage is giving you a uh, dope features. All of these features in the price of 179 USD dollars, which is a lot to be honest if you ask me. The price should be uh, been low considering to the features, but if the money is not a problem for you, and definitely go for it. Moreover, Ponage is giving a warranty of one year on their products with seven days money back guarantee. Well, this was the Pony Stormbreaker Magnesium Gaming Mouse. If you like the video, do give it a huge thumbs up and also subscribe to our YouTube channel and I will see you into the next one. Thank you.